August 21st, I turned 18. That means it is legal for me to do a bunch of stuff that was not legal before. I have my wonderful friend Ariel with me. She's gonna help me out with this video today for moral support, because not all of this stuff is very easy. There's the needle that's gonna go literally through my ear. And most of it is probably gonna piss off my mom. I still should find out what's going on. I'm old enough to rent an apartment. She'll find out later. Yes. Um, <laughs> now that I'm 18, I thought I'd do 18 things that you couldn't do before you turned 18 that you can now do. Though I don't recommend all of them. Let's do it. If I'm found guilty for doing something highly illegal, instead of being sent to juvie, now that I'm over 18, I'll be sent here to prison. So obey the law because before you know it, you're 18 and you'll end up here if you don't. So apparently you're not actually allowed to buy cough syrup until you're 18. So uh, we're gonna get me some NyQuil in case I ever need it. Another thing that you can't buy until you're 18 apparently, I didn't even know this until we started doing some research, is spray paint. So we're gonna get some spray paint and have some fun with this. I'm a big boy now because I can buy this stuff. I'm actually here doing this. I am so scared. Do you guys realize how much blood they take out of you? It's a whole pint. Apparently the process takes 45 minutes and they just hook you up to a machine that just sucks out your blood like a vampire. I'm terrified, but it can help save lives. So I just got to get over myself and do it. I don't want to pass out involuntarily. Apparently that's something that happens to some patients. There's nobody likes to black out. Okay, it's not as bad as I thought yet, but who knows how much blood is going to come out of me. And that's it. I feel fine. I'm glad I got over myself, even though I was so terrified. There's nothing to be scared of. It was easy. Knowing how easy it was and knowing how beneficial it is for other people, maybe I'll come back and do it again. You should too. Let's head home, but on the way home, let's pick up some dry ice since you can't buy that until you're 18. Thank you for joining me, Ariel. So dry ice gets its name because it doesn't melt. It actually evaporates from an ice. Make sure you guys stay tuned because we might actually use dry ice to blow something up. It'll be fun. Wait, what? Ethan. Ethan, what? It'll be fine. You ready, Ariel? Let's go have some fun. Oh, goodness. This doesn't seem very safe. It'll be completely safe as long as you stand back far enough. What? This stuff is not something you should ever touch with your bare hands, or else you will get frostbite. You can set the bottle down, and we just need to crush it up, stick it in the bottle, and- All right, let's close this up. Oh, God. All right, let's stand back. Get back, get back, get back. It's already going up. Oh, there it goes. Oh, my God. Oh. There is no bottle left. <laughs> <laughs> that was Isn't that cool? Don't try that at home unless you have adult supervision or of course, if you're 18 at least. For those of you who do not know, I am an ambassador for the American Taekwondo Association. They're sending out another contract because I'm actually gonna be an ambassador for another year. Now that I'm 18, my mom doesn't have to sign it for me. So I'm here with a notary who is gonna help me get this contract signed. Hi. Hi. Hey. Nice to see you. I understand you're coming in to sign a contract. Yes. It looks like you can sign a date right here and you wanna sign it the way they've got it listed. This is the first time I've actually signed a contract without my parents, so thank you for being here for moral support. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay. That's another one done. Let's keep going. Another thing that you can do once you turn 18 is own a car. I did buy my own car, but my mom officially owns it. So now I'm going to get the title changed so that it's in my name so that I can officially own my car. Let's go to the DMV and get this title. I am now the official owner of my car. Yay! I just needed a hug. Thank you so much. It took a long time in there. I had an idea. Okay. I'm 18 now and I can book a hotel room. <laughs> Why would you need a hotel room? What would we do with that? I don't know. I mean, I it's just some one of those things I can do, you know? <laughs> okay, let's do it. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, cool. Let's go get a hotel room. Yo, that hotel room is nice. Yeah, yeah so we just got to figure out something we're going to do with the room because I only have it for one night. Yeah. And I don't want to do it for nothing. I don't know. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll figure something out. Yeah. So one of the things you cannot do until you're 18 is get a credit card specifically for yourself. I had a credit card before, but I think it was under my mom's name and I shop at Costco all the time. So I'm gonna get a Costco card. I need to apply for a credit card. Okay. Do you have your ID on yet? Yes. Are you a Costco member? No. What do I sign? Just right here. Thank you so much. Of course. Does this place look familiar? This is the same Petco that Brighton and I actually got Jeffrey the Lizard that I had for a while. And it's also the place that Brighton got the guinea pig for Kaysen when he did his video on turning 18. I know my mom doesn't love animals. No, it's huge. It'll get two times bigger. Or uh, at least pets that she wasn't expecting in the house. But it's something I can do now without her permission. And my sister likes animals. She might be happy with a guinea pig. So now that I'm 18, I'm going to get one and give it to Greg. Here we are at the guinea pig section. They're really cute. I don't think I've actually ever held a guinea pig. Just hold them up close to your chest like a baby. Hello. Oh, they're not as soft as I thought. So cute. I think this is the one I'm going to get for Greg. Oh, yay. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> yay. I'm loving this. I can tell it does not. Not like me. He's sniffing my hand. You got some sharp nails. All right, buddy. We're gonna go in the box for now, buddy. Should we name a buddy? Hi, buddy. Time to take you home. Gray's gonna be so happy. One guinea pig. 
So I just got home and Ray isn't home yet. She's actually at work. So I'll be able to give this to her later, but I thought I'd show my mom first. Hey, mom? Yeah. I got something really cool. I thought it'd be a nice present for Gray. Oh yeah? Yeah. What is that? It's a guinea pig. But she lives here. I know. I know she'd like it because she's a huge animal lover like myself. And that is one of the things I can do now that I'm 18. So let me make sure I got this straight. You went to a pet store, still live here in my house, and you didn't get my permission to buy another pet to be able to have in this house to live. Do I have that right? I have that right, don't I? Well, it wasn't for me. Was have we me. not learned anything from the last experience? This is not okay. That went really well. Does she know about this pet yet? No, I thought I'd surprise her. Yeah, yeah. Here's the surprise. She's not even going to know about it. Take it back. I said they wouldn't take it back. What? I don't know where to put it in. Take it back. Find somebody else. It's not living here. Bye. His name is Buddy. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Hope you find a good home. That didn't work out so well. Man, Gray's gonna be so disappointed. Well, actually, she won't feel anything because she won't know about it. Guys, don't tell her I tried to get her a guinea pig and then failed. Any of my emotional support friend? I wonder how it's going. How did it go? Mm, I guess I can't say I expected it to go well. She said you'll have to return him somewhere. We do have a hotel room that we can stick him in for the night. That's an idea. Let's do it. Okay. I'm sorry, buddy. Another thing I just thought of that you can do once you turn 18 is be allowed to handle venomous snakes. Wait, you want to do that? Well, yeah, I have three pet snakes. Of course I want to do that. So are you down to go like look for some rattlesnakes with me so we can probably do that? <laughs> no. Have fun. Oh, uh, thanks. Good luck. I never recommend anybody do this. This right here is one of the great things about coming here to look for milk snakes is if we don't see milk snakes, this is another one of the things we'll see. Oh, yeah, it's not liking that. Another thing you can do is kind of put them under your armpit like that. And this is just an insane looking snake. Hey guys, I just found myself a nice comfy place to do a couple things that you can't do until you're 18 years old. First one I'm gonna do is actually register to vote. Once you're 18, you can vote for whoever you want to be president. All right, that's the first one. Next up, you can't write a will until you're 18. So we're gonna do that online as well. It's asking me if I want to give away anything I have for my future kids. That is if I have any, I don't know. What will they want? Will they want anything I have now? I don't know. The last one I wanna do here is to update my passport. So I have my current passport passport with me and look how cute I was. So yeah, we're gonna get this baby renewed. The will was 30 bucks, the passport is 35. That's $65 I'm paying. Guys, being an adult is expensive. Another thing you can do once you're 18 is get your ear pierced without your parents' permission. I'm gonna do it without my mom knowing. <laughs> we're here at Claire's and these are the ones I picked out. I think I'm just gonna do one ear. I'm gonna do the right ear. I'm really scared if it's gonna like hurt a lot. I'm kind of scared to see how this goes. There's the needle that's gonna go literally through my ear. Why do people do this? Just like aim for this like fleshy part. That would be ideal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna see if you like that dot. What do you think? Yep, that's perfect. Can you like count down or something? Yeah. All right. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, that hurts. Okay. Wow. Yeah. All right, guys. How does it look? How's your boy look? Wait, that actually looks awesome. I love it. You did pretty good. good. You did amazing. Thank you so much. Now to break the news to my mom. Hey, uh, mom. Just got back from Claire's. Notice anything different about me? What? That's nice. Anything else? What did you do? <laughs> I got a piercing. You never even told me you were thinking about that. Well, I don't have to anymore. <laughs> do you understand what you just did to yourself? There's a hole in your ear now. But I think it looks really good. Yeah, I mean. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't tell you, but I was like, I'm 18 now. You it's are. one of the things I can do now. Yeah, you are. No, I, you like it? I love it. Then I'm happy for you. I'll get used to it. Oh. Well, great. Thanks for being chill. Guys, I got a chill mom. You're filming this? Well, yeah, this is a YouTube video of things you can do once you're over 18. Oh, what else are you doing? No, nothing. I gotta go. Uh, you, you still have to live here. I still should find out what's going on. I'm old enough to rent an apartment. What are you gonna do in your apartment? Ethan, come back here. Okay, you know that really, really cool sword I won at a tournament one time? Yeah. I sold it at a pawn shop. You what? I'm at the pawn shop now. Something you actually can't do until you're 18 is actually sell an item of yours to a pawn shop. Something I have that I don't use is one of the swords I've won from one of my previous tournaments. I'm gonna give it to them and see how much they're willing to pay for it. Here's a sword. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It is just a China made blade, so it's one that we'd probably offer you 10 on. Really? Mm -hmm. That's actually more than I was expecting. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Bro, I honestly thought we would get like five bucks max. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's go. Why? Because I can do that now. But you I... worked hard to get that. Well, I... That was up on the wall. It's a great memory. I have a few others. Well, it here... was my money that we used to put you in the tournament. All right, then I'll give you the money that I got for it, okay? That's all they gave you? $10? Hey, I was expecting five. For $10? 
Are you kidding me? You should have asked. Sorry. That's my memory too, not just yours. Whoops. Well, uh, those are the only things I did now that I'm 18. Um, I'm gonna see the video. Mm, no, you're not. What am I gonna find out? Are you sure you don't wanna warn me now? Mm-hmm. What did you do? So how many things have we done? Uh, we've done about 16 now. So we only have okay. a couple left, but I didn't know there were so many things you could do once you turn 18. I didn't know there was more than like 10. Yeah, so. <laughs> that's been awesome. Yeah. So what else can we do? I guess maybe. What? I can do it. Do what? We're friends. Yeah. Let's get married. <laughs> Good one. Oh. Are you serious? Well, I mean, I'm 18 now, so I don't need permission from my parents. It's one of the things. Uh, I guess that's a good reason to get married nowadays. So? Well, if you're gonna propose to me, at least you're right. Okay, uh, Ariel, will you marry me? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> totally not a ring I got from World Championships one time, but it does have real diamonds in there, so. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, all right, so, are you ready? I guess. Why did you change? Is that a different shirt? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I wanted to look nice. Well, you should have told me. I'm just wearing the same thing. That's okay. I was just trying to at least get on your level. All right, you ready to do this? I think so. Let's go. We just have to sign these forms and we'll be good to go. I guess we're doing this. I'm Judge Reese Jacobson, and I'm really excited to be a part of this today. Now, this is a really unusual wedding. I've never officiated a wedding like this, so I, you guys want to go through with this? Um, kinda. Yeah, sorta. Of. Okay. Oh, yeah, sorry. All right, so we'll make this quick. What was your name? Ariel Grace. Ariel Grace, do you take... Ethan Feinschreiber. Ethan Feinschreiber to be your lawfully wedded husband? <laughs> I guess. Do you take Ariel Grace to be your lawfully wedded wife? Why not? So repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed? Very good. Now, do you have a ring for her? Oh, I'm supposed to have two. I was supposed to have one to one I propose and then one for... Um, yeah. Oh, here. Okay, repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. <laughs> All right. It's supposed to be in the ring finger. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Congratulations, you two. I knew I would find a purpose for this. Check this out. Did you want to like stay married and work on this? Mm, no. No, okay. Let's just get this annulled. It'll be like this never happened. And that's another thing you can do once you're 18, get an annulment. So I'm gonna go do that. Well, guess that's it. 